Hey guys, how you guys doing? Um, I'm just gonna do this random little video, and we're gonna be playing some Resident Evil 1. Um, just basically how the game starts for, with a question. How do you like your games? Like climbing a mountain, fulfilling, but but takes a lot of work. Like going on a hike, good exercise, but not too strenuous. Like taking a walk, you can relax and enjoy yourself. Hmm. I'll go for the second one. Ooh, Chris Redfield or Jill. Let's go with baby girl Jill. Alpha team is flying around the forest zone situated in northwest Raccoon City where we are searching for the helicopter of our compatriots, Bravo Team, who disappeared during the middle of their Is mission. Found it yet? No, not yet, Brad. Bizarre murder cases have recently occurred in Raccoon City. There are outlandish reports of families being attacked by a group of about ten people. Victims were apparently eaten. The Bravo Team was sent in to investigate. But we lost contact. Look, Chris! Bravo Team's helicopter was a derelict. So I kind of know this game from the back of my hand, because I used to play it when I was younger. So Safe we'll see how I do after all these years. We continued our search for the other members. And it turned into a nightmare. Come on, Jail, don't don't just sit there. Oh yeah, this was before Chris was like super buff. Chris this way. Enter the survival horror. There are only three STARS members left now. Captain Wesker, Barry, and myself. We don't know where Chris is. What is this place? Not quite your ordinary house, that's for sure. Hey, Whisker, where's Chris? Jill, no. You don't want to go back out there. But we've got to find... What was that? Chris? No. Jill, go and investigate. 
I'm going with her. Chris and I go back a long way. All right. You two go. I'll secure this area. Stay sharp. I'm probably doing this like ass backwards because I did a whole playthrough of two, then three, and now I'm going back to one. And I think I have a video of zero? I don't remember. A dining room. This mansion is a lot more brighter than I thought. Or what I remembered. Ooh. Ooh. This is really smooth. I think you'd better take a look at this. What is it? Blood. Well, don't Jill. eat it. Let's see if you can find any other clues. I'll be examining this. Let's just hope it's not Chris's. I mean, you can't really anana. What, what, you're just gonna eyeball it. It's like, mm hmm. It smells like Chris. Mm hmm. Let's go over here. So I played this game before. So I remember it. I remember what to do vaguely. Oh, the iconic scene. Okay, first things first. So that we don't waste any bullets, we go back. You'll understand in a minute. What is it? Look out! It's a monster! Let me take care of it! What the hell is this thing? I found Kenneth killed by this thing. Let's report this to Wesker. See? Now that zombie's taken care of. Without wasting any bullets. Or not? I don't remember it ever leaving. Wesker! Jill, help me look for him. Let's not leave this hall. Good idea. So I think for this, you literally have to just go upstairs. Do the like, do a little loop around. Yeah, you literally just have to do that. Any luck, Jill? No, nothing. What's going on around here? I can't figure it out. Damn, Save Jill, here. look at that booty. Chris and now Wesker. There's not much we can do. We can search for him separately. I'll investigate the dining room. Okay, then. I'll try the door on the other side. <sighs> this mansion is gigantic. We could easily get lost. Let's start from the first floor. Okay. Oh! I almost forgot. It's a lockpick. You'd make oh, it. Yeah, I totally forgot that this game kind of like... Kind of handhold you Thanks. with Jill a little it. bit? Listen. Not so much with Something Chris. Happens. Let's meet up in this hall. Got it? Okay. Oh, okay, never mind. We gotta go this way, I believe. Okay, we go up here. Go down here. I believe this is a map. All right, cool. Then we go through here. Pick up the knife so we learn about self-defense. 
and then we just continue. Okay, let's see if I can dodge this without being eaten. Over here, and then over here. Ooh! I get to keep my knife. Nice. Alright, that saves me the trouble of that one. Yeah, in this game, you kind of need to be very conserv like conservative. Alright, I don't need that ink ribbon for now. But I got one knife just in case I get grabbed. It's all on a videotape. So like I said, I know this game from the back of my hand. Some things. Ooh. More handgun ammo. I'm gonna need that. Hello? Dead body? Nah, it's just... Just a dead body. Okay, some herbs. Even more herbs. Okay, that works out there. What the hell? Yeah, there's no way. You're alive. He's good. He's good now. Okay, that works out that. Okay, there's a zombie over there. Ooh, what's this? I'll take it. Should I get rid of you? Hello? Are you there? Okay, yeah, he's over here. These freaking camera angles, my guy. Okay, is he down? Oh, oh no. Oh, first things first. Let's get rid of this. This is going to be for later. Yeah, I gotta remember that there's two zombies there I gotta come back for. Because, like, in this game, they don't really stay dead. If you leave the bodies there, they just get worse. And it's not ideal. It's locked. Okay, so let's go buy some of this stuff. Alrighty then. I think we gotta go to the graveyard now. I don't think there's any zombies here. I don't think. Should be shotgun shells here. Yep. Alright, 
cool. Like, this room does not make any sense. Wait, no, I want it. Why did I say no? Thank you. There's a key behind it. Nice. Now we can open up some doors. These controls feel so freaking great. Like, they fixed up this game a lot. I'm happy about that. Okay, so I need to get to... I need to unlock a couple things. Let's go upstairs first. Okay, that's locked on the other side, but we get to go through here. Can't grab that yet. Could grab that one. Can't grab that yet. I mean, I can. There we go. That's not what I wanted. There it is. Oh no. Oh, he's not going down. Okay, he's down. A little save room. Okay. Ooh. Let's put the health there. Let's put you here because I'm not going to need you. The knife is useless in this run. I mean, honestly, it is useless. Canister here. Let me just show you guys what I'm talking about for for you to actually like get rid of the zombies I'm gonna have to go back and deal with the other two that I killed upstairs So you, you burn the body so they don't come back stronger like so. And that's literally about it. That's literally the easiest part. Now that the bodies will just disappear. Another herb. Let's refill the ganster for me. There we go. And then let's put this away. 
think there's something else around here, right? Yeah, whatever. But anyways, guys, this is going to be it about this one. Uh, I hope you enjoy.